Hi, this is Krista at Snuggle and Snore. What should we name our puppy? It's a tough question, right? So how it worked out is the breeder is in Czech Republic and depending on the birth order and which litter the puppy's from, there was a certain letter their name had to start with for their pedigree documents. Now you can always name your dog something else, but if you're lucky enough to know your dog from when he is born, or at least see him from when he's born, um, he's still like two weeks away. Anyway, if you're lucky enough, then she offered me the opportunity to come up with names for their pedigree papers or the export documentation. The boy, had to, his name had to start with a CH, so I went through all the CHs and liked, you know, there's Charlie or Chuck, and then I, then I found Churchill, and it was a surprise for my husband for his birthday, and his favorite dogs are uh, English Bulldogs. So, and he always does name his dogs after presidents or military commanders or you know people of importance throughout history. So I was like, Churchill, that would be great because he, we haven't had a Churchill before. And of course, Churchill is iconic, he's great. So that worked out really great. The girl needed to be named with a J. Went through all of the J names and couldn't find any that fit, that were, you know, symbolic and right. The only thing I could come up with was Jackie, like Jackie Onassis, but then, you know, you're going to call her Jax or, you know, like just some, you know, it wasn't that great. And I knew my husband wouldn't like it because he is into, you know, more authoritar author authoritative names or like more important, um, uh, well, he just names his dogs. He wouldn't name it after a celebrity. You know what I mean? So that was that. I didn't even report it to the breeder because I knew he wouldn't really like it anyway, so I don't even know what her pedigree name is. But coming up with another name for her, difficult. Like if you just take the J out of it and you name her anything in the world, what would you name her to go with Churchill? We are having a really hard time with it. The closest we have come, we did, we did Jackie for a while, we did Ching for a while, and now we've moved on to just Clementine. Clementine was Churchill's wife, and they are a breeding pair. For they're from different litters, et cetera, et cetera. So Clementine is what we're at right now. It's not really... Uh, we just don't want to be calling her like Clemmy or Clammy or, you know, like if you shorten Clementine, is there a good shortening to it? I don't know. You're not going to call her Clementine every day. You'll call her Clem and that's close to Clam. And then you don't want to be calling your dog Clam. You know what I mean? So what name could we come up with for her? Uh, we already have named a dog after Margaret Thatcher. So that one's off the table. She was great. That was my boxer. She lived for 16 years, best boxer ever. I did have one other dog. Well, I had a couple of the dogs that were also super great, but she was my best boxer for sure. And the great grandmother of my big dogs right now. They look like Rottweilers. You'd never know they have boxer in them at all. They're massive, 115 pounds. They're like really big, really great dogs. But I got tape on my ass. <laughs> but what can we call the baby girl? She's so cute. She's like delicate, she's lighter than her brother. He's, she's lighter in color than Churchill. Super adorable. What would we call her? So let me know what ideas you have in the comments box below and let's come up with a name for her. I think we have like 15 days left before she arrives, which is getting close to two weeks, right? I just can't wait. I can't wait. It's almost hard to sleep. It's hard to breathe. Like, I just, I just can't wait. I can't wait. I mean, I have to wait. I'm waiting. I can't wait. I can't wait. Like, I just, oh. Anyway, I'm sure you know the pain I'm in. So, thanks so much for hanging out. If you have any ideas for naming her, let me know in the comments below, and we'll see you in the next video. Right? Oh my gosh. I mean, it can't be clammy. Hey, clam. Hey, clam. Ching. It's not good, right? <laughs>